Google has made a groundbreaking announcement, introducing their latest AI model, RoboCat. Developed using DeepMind's renowned generalist AI, Gato, RoboCat is being hailed as the most advanced self-learning artificial intelligence ever created. Why? Well, it boasts an impressive repertoire of over 600 tasks. But that's not it. This development is set to revolutionize the world of AI and accelerate the pace of technological advancement. Join us as we find out more about the RoboCat. But before we get into this, remember to subscribe to our channel to stay updated for new uploads. What is RoboCat? RoboCat is an extraordinary invention that combines cutting-edge transformers and reinforcement learning advancements. It builds upon its predecessor, Gato, which was widely recognized for its ability to process language, images, and actions in both simulated and physical environments. What distinguishes RoboCat is its exceptional capacity to surpass these foundational elements. It achieves this by continuously improving and adapting itself to various real-world tasks and robotic arms. Unlike traditional robots programmed for specific tasks, RoboCat demonstrates that robots can learn, adapt, and enhance their abilities across different tasks using a diverse dataset. With over 100 demonstrations, RoboCat can comprehend and perform a new task, showcasing an unprecedented acceleration in this field. RoboCat is revolutionizing robotics research and development with its remarkable capabilities. One of the key aspects that sets RoboCat apart is its unique self-improvement process. Initially, it undergoes training using an extensive dataset of images and actions from various robot arms engaged in hundreds of tasks. Once this initial training is completed, RoboCat enters a cycle of self-improvement that underscores its distinctiveness. RoboCat collects new task demonstrations during this cycle through a human-controlled robotic arm. It then refines its learning for the new task, creating a specialized agent. This agent practices the task around 10,000 times, generating new training data. This valuable data is subsequently integrated into RoboCat's existing training dataset. Finally, a new version of RoboCat is trained on this dataset, thereby completing the cycle. Opening Paragraph RoboCat's training journey was incredible. It was trained on a diverse dataset of millions of trajectories, encompassing real and simulated scenarios. This allowed RoboCat to quickly adapt to multiple tasks using various types of robots and robotic arms, capturing vision-based data. In just 1,000 demonstrations, RoboCat showcased its proficiency with a complex robotic arm equipped with a three-fingered gripper and double the controllable inputs, achieving an impressive 86% success rate in picking up gears. It also demonstrated its precision and understanding by selecting the right fruit from a bowl and solving a shake-matching puzzle. RoboCat's training experience, combining real and simulated scenarios, empowered it to operate different robotic arms effortlessly and excel in complex tasks. RoboCat's training cycle The virtuous cycle RoboCat experiences during training is fascinating. It's like how humans deepen their knowledge and skills through experience, setting RoboCat apart from other systems. The fascinating aspect lies in how each new task it learns enhances its ability to learn additional tasks. This powerful training process continually refines RoboCat's capabilities, elevating it to new heights. In its initial version, RoboCat achieved a 36% success rate on tasks it had never encountered before. This impressive result was obtained after learning from 500 demonstrations per task. However, the latest version of RoboCat surpasses all expectations. It underwent a more extensive range of task training, and the outcome was astounding. This remarkable improvement can be attributed to RoboCat's five-step training process. But before we continue, remember to like the video. Step 1. Collect 100 to 1,000 demonstrations of a new task using a human-controlled robotic arm. Step 2. Fine-tune RoboCat on the new task to create a specialized agent. Step 3. The specialized agent practices the new task around 10,000 times to generate even more training data. Step 4. The new demonstration is integrated, and the self-generated data is fed into RoboCat's existing training dataset. Step 5. Training of an updated version of RoboCat on this enhanced training dataset. How RoboCat improves itself. RoboCat, an advanced robotic agent, 
follows a five-step sequence to master new tasks and enhance its adaptability with different robotic devices. This ability for independent learning and rapid self-improvement represents a significant leap forward in general-purpose robotics. VPT and its applications OpenAI recently introduced a groundbreaking video pre-training method, combining reinforcement learning with extensive video training. The AI model was exposed to approximately 70,000 hours of raw gameplay videos and a smaller set of videos processed by humans. Through this process, the model observed, learned to predict, imitate, and ultimately master the behaviors exhibited by human players. By training on this video data, OpenAI developed a foundational model capable of predicting future actions based on past inputs and frames. When deployed in Minecraft, the model displayed its zero-shot capabilities, executing complex tasks at a frame rate of 20 Hz using simulated mouse and keyboard inputs. It excelled at crafting a table from logs in under 50 seconds. This task typically takes an average human player the same amount of time. The AI model underwent further training, using early game Minecraft gameplay videos to enhance its performance during the game's early stages. Consequently, it demonstrated improved abilities in creating wooden and stone tools and basic skills in building shelters and exploring villages. Beyond robotics, OpenAI has introduced MineRL, their own self-learning artificial intelligence. An exciting development emerged when this AI successfully learned to craft a diamond pickaxe in the popular open-world game Minecraft. Although this achievement may seem trivial initially, its implications are transformative and far-reaching. Minecraft has presented a fascinating challenge for AI researchers, serving as a complex sandbox environment. In 2019, OpenAI launched the MineRL Challenge to teach AI various tasks within this vast virtual universe. The intricacies of this world demanded an AI system that surpassed traditional reinforcement learning methods. To overcome this hurdle, OpenAI took a hybrid approach, combining imitation learning from human players with reinforcement learning. This approach led to remarkable progress in enabling AI to navigate and accomplish increasingly complex tasks within the vibrant and intricate universe of Minecraft. VPT proved an immensely successful approach, empowering AI models to learn and excel in Minecraft through extensive video training. OpenAI embarked on an even greater challenge by combining reinforcement learning with a pre-trained VPT model to craft a diamond pickaxe. This innovative approach led to remarkable progress, significantly improving the AI agent over standard reinforcement learning agents. It crafted iron pickaxes 80% of the time and diamond pickaxes 2.5% of the time, matching the performance of an average human player. Impressively, the AI agent also developed advanced mining skills, including efficient mining patterns and utilizing wood pickaxes as fuel when transitioning to iron tools. OpenAI has exciting plans for future experiments, such as incorporating up to a million hours of Minecraft training videos for further refinement. They have also tested integrated voice training with video training, potentially granting some control over the AI agent. This approach can be extended to other domains requiring sequential decision-making by utilizing free available online video data. By fine-tuning the VPT model with additional data, OpenAI aims to create AI agents using reinforcement learning in various applications. Learning through the keyboard and mouse interface allows the AI model to emulate a wide range of human behavior, making it applicable in domains with substantial unlabeled data and potential everyday software use. OpenAI's groundbreaking work in Minecraft demonstrates its ability to redefine the boundaries of AI's capabilities, from crafting in digital worlds to potentially navigating real-world tasks. Let us know your opinions in the comments below. We'll see you next time.